So, hey guys, Chauce here. And this time I'm bringing you a fairly accessible team with no new badge against the Boa Blitz. Uh, most inaccessible unit is this Luffy, but I know many people wanted to pull him on his debut, so I hope this does help quite a few people. This is basically a no star speedrun team, we need to start one turn on stage 4. And yeah, it's pretty funny during this stream because I built three teams, and two of them ended up having a random Mori on the team. And both of them have that Mori as like the final unit I added, so... It's pretty absurd. Shouldn't really happen, but it has happened, so it is what it is. But yeah, should be fine to just auto battle until stage 3. On stage 3 we're doing the strat that basically everybody are doing, which is just use the Blackbeard friend captain. He handles every single variant, just use him and you kill, very easy. And we're going to save Blackbeard's super for the final stage. On this stage we're going to stall, but as long as we stall we handle everything. Stalling will let Doffy super reduce the CD for most of the team. The, most Im the only important one is Perona, but basically Doffy lets me use Doffy and Perona special now. Um, Doffy. Gives us attack or boost matching orbs. Then Perona will remove all of the bad effects. Including the attack down and the burn and the bind. And the call affinities. No, Perona easily won it KO. So very fast. And yeah, now we're pretty much set for final stage. Uh, we're going to be using... Uh, this Alvaro Pizarro, he will give an ore boost, remove most of the bind. He's also a Blackbeard member for the friend Captain Blackbeard, so we can use this super. Jimbe for a bit of ore boost, we use Moria. He will do a small attack boost, but it's two turns, so we get to keep it. Luffy will buff the attack boost and give a chain boundary. Nami support to remove the bind, Blackbeard super to remove the death up. And then you just burst. Ending with Blackbeard, but you probably won't even need to hit with Blackbeard. This is a lot of damage. So yeah, accessible team. Very happy with it. Let's just double check what the boost is. Won't be the highest, but it's a workable team. I'm happy with it. It's like, it's super fast too. 2.8, very, very low, but this is a nightmare blitz for many. So I hope this team can help some at least. So yeah. That's the end of this video. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.